Hey everybody, it's Eric, 80s Horror Man here, and welcome to Day 7 for my 31 Days of Horror. Yes, so I'll be reviewing one movie, one day to a time. Right. So today, I'm doing a movie that was done in 1986. It was put out by a restaurant. I never had a movie on DVD, but I used to have the bootleg copy of it on Blu-ray, but ever since restaurant put this out on Blu-ray, I figured ditch the bootleg and get the actual Blu-ray itself. And it is from a Stephen King movie. And this is the movie that Stephen King wrote and directed himself. And that's Maximum Overdrive. Vit. I remember seeing this movie so many times a long time ago when I was a kid. We used to have this on tape. And this movie is just a lot of fun to watch. Basically, Maximum Overdrive, this is about where a comet comes to Earth and it makes every single machine you come to life and it just fucks everything up but mostly it has something to do with trucks making the trucks come alive and you have like a small group of survivors trapped in a truck stop trying to avoid these these uh, trucks there's just circling the area and the survivors are just trying to find a way to to get out although there is some funny parts in this movie like in the very beginning in the, when the movie opens after it showed a comic coming to earth and how usually when you go into town and you pass a, a bank or whatever and it displays the time and the temperature and all of a sudden it and it changes saying fuck you fuck you that one I got a kick out of and the other one is like when in the Stephen King it, in, he always makes cameo appearances in his movies. Approaches the ATM, inserts his card into the ATM machine, and on the screen it says, You are an asshole. And he's like, Honey, come on over here, sugar buns. The, lift up his uh, sunglasses, and the screen kept saying, Asshole, asshole. And he said, This machine just called me an asshole. <laughs> that one was also good, too. But another one that was also pretty pretty good that I got a kick out of in the, the baseball coach decided to go to the vending machine to get some sodas for the for the team and he inserts the quarters hits the selection of the sodas and apparently nothing happens hits the machine and next you know that's when you see a, sh a soda can just shoot out and hit the coach right in the nuts which and it just like oh <laughs> then it hits him in the chest and it just hits him in the head and just kills him then you have just like a vending machine just spitting out soda cans attacking the kids on the baseball field so, Maximum Overdrive, written and directed by Stephen King. I thought Stephen King did a good job directing this movie himself. And I thought Emilio Estevez did a pretty good job as the main character, as the truck stop cook, trying to get the survivors out of the truck stop. So, Maximum Overdrive is definitely a good time to watch. I highly recommend checking this out for people who haven't seen this movie, but if you have, you know what I'm talking about, but... Out of a possible 10, I give this movie an 8.5 out of 10 because this movie is just so much fun to watch and I highly recommend checking this movie out from Stephen King. So, Maximum Overdrive, very fun movie to watch. Alright guys, so that's my uh, review for Day 7 for my 31 Days of Horror. Uh, what do you guys think? Have you seen this movie before? Please let me know in the comments down below on what your thoughts on it. And like and subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for some more videos. Later.